Northern Ireland has a complex government system as a result of the peace process. Opposing political parties share and rotate leadership positions. To be a leader in Northern Ireland, one must be willing to work with the other side. <coughs> Gavin Robinson, a member of the Ulster Project in 2000, became the Lord Mayor of Belfast at the age of 27. He's acknowledged as a rising political star in Northern Ireland. Born and raised in Belfast, Robinson is promoting reconciliation between Protestant and Catholic groups. Where I grew up, it was a predominantly unionist area, uh, one in which uh, there was little opportunity for contact, even if the will was there. Political leaders like Robinson are working hard to quell conflict and foster peace in Northern Ireland. Cities like Belfast are painted with antagonizing political and religious symbols that mark neighborhoods. The Ulster Project creates opportunities for teens from segregated communities to mix and gain understanding for the other side. These lessons and experiences help them grow into successful leaders of the community. But got to see uh, a side of the community in which I come from, got to see something that ordinarily would not have been open to me, but enjoy it, and from that perspective, barriers were just removed. Robinson also explained that participants in the Ulster Project form friendships and relationships that transcend societal tensions. Young people have the ability to fuel and continue the peace and reconciliation process in Northern Ireland. Well, for the, the approach uh, that the city should take for that civic vision that we have to make sure that we continue to move forward uh, and build a positive and a progressive and a welcoming city, one which is not only dealing with the issues that we have had, uh, but one which is open uh, and accessible for all of our international friends. Although the peace walls divide neighbourhoods, Northern Ireland is making significant strides in the reconciliation process. However, barbed wire still runs through many neighborhoods. Tensions still run high. Robinson sees the importance of the Ulster Project to help create a peaceful Northern Ireland in the future. Uh, I want to give sincere thanks uh, for the commitment, the ongoing commitment, uh, the dedication and the interest uh, that we have got uh, from families, from individuals um, right across the United States of America. It means so much to individuals like me. It means so much to, uh, I believe, children that have gone before uh, who are now <coughs> greatly exceeding me in the, in the paths of life and have had the intrinsic benefits of the Ulster Project. But more importantly, those who remain untouched uh, by the benefits that the Ulster Project has to offer uh, and the inspiring opportunity that is there when we recognise uh, that our future will be successful, but it's got to be a collective one.